An activist battle is brewing at DuPont's Delaware headquarters, and that makes DuPont today's chart of the day. The battle for DuPont's future will reach its climax today when shareholders learn whether the company was able to hold off a power grab by activist investor Nelson Peltz. Peltz's try-in management hedge fund is nominated four candidates for the board, including himself. Peltz has advocated splitting DuPont into two companies, cutting costs, increasing leverage, and divesting non-core assets such as the DuPont Country Club and Hotel DuPont. DuPont CEO Ellen Coleman and the company's management has opposed Peltz's plan since the proxy war began in early January. She maintains a plan would destroy shareholder value and gut the company's research and development units. Since Coleman took over, the company has delivered 266 percent in total shareholder returns, easily outpacing the S&P 500. Now, shareholders have been voting on the plan for weeks, and those results will be unveiled today. DuPont shares closed down 55 cents Tuesday at 74.85. And that is why DuPont is today's chart of the day. For The Street, I'm Jane King.